There must come a time when the Queen bows to the will of the people. The Republic has brought nothing but war and death. In our 50 years of flying their colors, we have had more war than the past millennia. Back General Vaclu in his effort to make her see reason. We do not need the Republic. They need our resources, our world, and our blood. For all that we have given now, we get nothing. The Republic is weak and falling apart. Its Jedi, whose fallen brethren have brought such misery to us, have disbanded. Let's be the first world to take our future into our hands. Are you with me? Exactly. That is all we ask. Close to two-thirds of Onderanians want to reclaim our independence, to isolate ourselves from the ravages of the Republic, to relive our golden age when we answered to no Senate. That's enough, Ponlar. If you keep this up, you're going to spend time in detention. You're coming awfully close to treason. You can't silence me forever, soldier. But I'll keep my peace. For now. The rumor I've heard is that you don't fully agree with our Queen and her supporters. If you're an adverse to Queen Talia stepping down, you could use your help. It would be quite worth your while. I am a strong supporter of General Vaklu. The Merchant Quarter is an important area. Not only financially, but strategically as well. It is one of the few districts that is directly connected to the Royal Palace. The Queen and her advisors are well aware of this and have ensured that the captains here are extremely loyal to her. This presents complications for Vaklu. If you could arrange for them to be removed from their command, you will be richly compensated. There's Galisi at the Starport. Riken commands from the Turret Tower. And Bastuko guards the entrance to the Skyrail. All loyal, and all need to be reassigned. About what? For each task you complete, I am prepared to pay you 2,500 credits. Plus you will earn the favor of some powerful people. We could make your job much easier here. You can't attack them directly. The entire city would be after you if you assaulted their checkpoints. You may have to be subtle. And patient. They don't have to be killed, just removed from command. There's Galisi. Whatever course you wish to take, aiding this woman may be useful. We may gain Vaklu's favor or learn more of his plans. Either way, helping Anda should be carefully considered. General Vaklu may be at odds with us now, but it need not always be that way. Sky ramp is restricted to military personnel only. Stay clear of here, Offworlder. I told you before, Offworlder, the sky ramp is restricted to military personnel only. Now move along. I am Captain Bastuko. I have served loyally in the Onderon military for 20 years. 20 years would mean you were here during the Mandalorian Wars, right? I was a soldier when the Mandalorians took our world, and I fought in the Resistance. When we drove them from Onderon, I served on the Wall for ten years after. You mean after the Jedi drove the Mandalorians from Onderon? The Mandalorians never gave ground to any Onderon soldier. Such of you could be considered treason. Onderon was responsible for much of the fighting during the last days of the war. Without General Vaklu, the Republic would have fallen. General Vaklu is my superior officer, and I respect the chain of command. He kept the Resistance alive when the Mandalorians were destroying our world. The Wall is the barrier between Isis and the Onderon Wilderness. For hundreds of years, we kept the city free of beasts and beast rider scum. The greatest honor for an officer is to serve on the Wall. Many aspire to the post, but few are worthy of it. I was requested to guard the sky ramp in the Merchant Quarter. My personal feelings on the matter are irrelevant. I received an order, and I carried it out. I... I feel a little lightheaded. Let me tell you what I feel. I have many good years of service left in me. I feel like I'm being set aside. They said they needed their best men here. But sky ramp duty has always been relegated to fresh officers. I couldn't do that. I heard the reassignments came from the Queen herself. Uh, I will request reassignment. Immediately. Troops, man the checkpoint without me. I must leave. 
at once. Welcome to what must be the smelliest place in the universe, Offworlder. How can I assist you? These are troubled times. You've probably heard that General Vaklu and Queen Talia are having some... disagreements. I've been warned from command to keep my opinions to myself on that. So I've learned my lesson, I'm gonna keep my mouth shut. Ask around, though. There are plenty of people who'd like nothing more than to talk about it. Times are too complex for a simple soldier like myself. Sometimes I made the mistake of answering questions honestly. If you say anything bad about a superior officer, they call that disrespecting the rank. Do that too many times and it's not long before you're a civilian. Yes, tell them what you really think, Riken. I don't think so. I know you'd like nothing better than getting me drummed out of the military, but I'm not gonna say a word. What I really mean? General Vaklu... Vaklu may be a war hero, but everything he's done since the war has been poison for us. And the Republic. There are rumors, always spoken quietly, that he has made alliances with dark powers. Things worse than the Freed and Nad movement from our past. I think... That's enough! You may be the Queen's pawn, Riken, but you will not rail against a brilliant general like Vaklu. Can't you see it? He's slick with words, but Vaklu's inner circle are responsible for dark deeds. Anyone that speaks out against him is labeled a rebel spy. You think the Republic needs a few hundred spies in Isis? Most spies are picked up in raids and never heard from again. It's just wrong. I will see you are relieved of your command for this. Your mouth just ended your career. No matter how distinguished your war record is, it is over! I don't know how much more help I'll be. Won't be in the military too much longer. I won't remain silent any longer! The Republic has actively attacked us! They attack our spaceships, unprovoked! What next? An invasion? Perhaps they seek to conquer us? Will you stand idly by? Will you let them bomb our city? No! If Queen Talia is so removed that she won't do what the people so clearly want, then we must show her with force! That's it, Ponlar. We're taking you in. You've gone too far. Brothers and sisters, let us rise up now and march to the palace. Our will cannot be denied. That's right! Death, Death to the Queen! queen. Death, Death, Death to the Allies! Grab arms! arms. We, we will march! Why are you joining in this? I prefer Vaklu over Talia, but this is hardly a task for a warrior. Shrewd. I hate to lower myself to joining this mob, but your plan may work. You would fight with them? This is madness! We need reinforcements! The Offworlder joins, joins us! Let's joins us. fight these rats! Let's fight these rats! The Royals must die! die. You look like an off-worlder. My name's Galisi. I'm a checkpoint captain at the Merchant Quarter. If you're here for Juma Juice, it's not that good. But at least it's cheap. I don't think Bith have the same sense of taste we do. Long day, as always. Sulio was captain of that checkpoint for years. I never knew why she came here every night until I got her job. Hmm. She was murdered. I didn't want her job, but I got it now. We stand at the checkpoints all day long. It gets hot out there and my feet are always killing me. But now I'm in charge and everybody's problems are mine. So I have to deal with all the people begging to get out of the city. Every one of them's got a story. Let me tell you, there are a lot of sad stories out there. Hmm. She was murdered. This Sulio was murdered. Maybe even assassinated. 
I might be a little paranoid. I have a wife and daughter to look after, and I feel like I'm a target now. I'm tempted to just grab my family and take the first shuttle out of here. I really am torn. There are days... There are some days where I think I'm a fool to stay. So the rumors are true. If you're working with who I think you are, I'll leave. Right now. Just don't hurt my family. I, I promise. I, I won't tell anyone. I'll be on the first shuttle out. Um, I'll be going. You must have gone through a lot to arrange this meeting. The palace is a full battle readiness. Smuggling in a message is no small task. Kavar, the famed Jedi Guardian. The Mandalorians counted on the fact it would be you, not Revan, who would lead the Jedi against us during the Mandalorian Wars. I wonder how we'd have fared against you. I thought you were killed fighting Malak during the Jedi Civil War. It seems my former student keeps curious company. Strange times lead to strange alliances, though. I have my ways as well. Why are you here? I imagine that you hold little love for any on the Jedi Council anymore. Even an old friend. You have to understand that it was a time of great uncertainty. We just learned that Darth Revan was back with an armada. Every Jedi that went with him was... lost. Corrupted. And as dark as their master. And then there was you. Many thought you were a spy. But there's more to it than that. And I think you deserve an expert. Am I interrupting? In orbit, I thought for sure that the Ebon Hawk was mine. I was certain. Only to see you slip through my fingers during the battle. Imagine my delight to discover you were on Isis. Quite careless, if you ask me. Get them, men! And watch your aim! Civilian casualties cause a mess of paperwork. I must return to the palace. I'll get word to you when I'm able. Run! What? What have you done to my men? Blast! Men, take care of him! I won't let Kavar escape! Observation. This is a great opportunity for slaughter. Area effect attacks, such as grenades, will do great damage to soldier and civilian alike. Stop the fighting! Stop! Sergeant, take care of the witnesses. I'm sorry we had to do that. Appearances have to be maintained, and I'm afraid we don't have much time. You've helped out General Vaklu, and he understands how to show gratitude. We have allies, terrible allies. They want you dead. However, the General believes you could ultimately be an even greater ally. But we have to maintain appearances. Do you understand? I meant no offense. I am sorry. A Sith Lord. No idea of the name. Frankly, we had no idea who we were dealing with at first. And by the time we did, it was too late. The General believes we can make a new alliance that will be in both of our interests. Vaklu wants to control all of Onderon. And perhaps more down the road. The Republic's time is nearly over and strong men like him will rule the age to come. You have shown that you are strong too, and he feels it inevitable that you become a force to be reckoned with. We'd like to ask your assistance in dealing with our ally, the Sith Lord. We have much to offer in return. We would send you a message to your Mandalorian allies on the Duxon Moon. We still need the Sith Lord to take care of a few things first, but after we've got what we need, then your assistance will be requested. Eventually, we will attack Queen Talia's palace. Isis is an ancient city filled with artifacts from our darker past. Some of those might be especially useful to you. Besides, the Sith Lord wants you dead, and an enemy of our enemy. For now, it's simple. We have to act like you're our enemy. When you leave this cantina, my men have orders to kill you. There is no way they could possibly stand up to you, but they don't know that. Leave Isis, and don't come back until we send a message for you. If the payment I've offered you is insufficient, I assure you General Vaklu himself can offer you a satisfactory deal. You must make a choice. Will you support us, or the Queen? Vaklu is a political animal, but 
but he has never backed out of a deal. The Sith must have changed their arrangements substantially for him to consider betraying them. You can trust his offer. He's far more capable than Queen Talia is. I think allying with him is the best course. Credibility is important in Onderon politics. If he betrayed you and betrayed the Sith, his reign would be a short one. Excellent. You won't regret this decision. We will contact you, like I told you. The men outside will try to kill you. We will talk later.